After the camshaft bearings are installed into the 3306 engine block, we can now proceed to the installation of the camshaft. During the installation process of the bearings, small shavings of the bearing material can peel off and clog the galley. It is best to use compressed air to free the passage from any dirt or debris. First, we begin by applying an even amount of lubricant to each camshaft bearing to prevent them from scuffing during the initial startup. If the camshaft, camshaft bearings, and all the valve train components are not properly lubricated, they can be damaged within the first few camshaft revolutions. Once the damage has occurred, no amount of lubrication will allow the camshaft to rotate and function properly. Now that the proper lubrication is set, we proceed to the cleaning of the camshaft to remove any excess grease to prevent damage of the part before it is put to use. Apply a small amount of lubrication to the rear journals and lobes of the camshaft and insert it into the block until you can support it on the first two journals. This will leave the remaining journals exposed so you can apply the lubrication. Continue applying the lubrication as you insert the camshaft in place. Finally, inspect the camshaft by carefully rotating it and making sure it is properly seated on each journal. CTP camshafts form part of the engine's valve train components and they are vital for the system's performance.